Hi guys and welcome back to my channel, The Black Widow here. It's really nice to be back after having some dramas and family issues and things going on. But I am back, I am in full form. I do have a couple of videos coming up really, really soon. Uh, this one in particular is just a, uh, a feeding video, just to kick things off. I get a bit bored of doing feeding videos, but why not? Um, and then the next video is going to be something a little different and then we've got a few a few things in the works um, maybe an unboxing a very big unboxing fairly soon uh, if that all goes to plan uh, but in the meantime let's just jump straight into this video and uh, I hope you guys enjoy it Okay, so first up on the uh, feeding list is my Nandu Chromatus. I'm sorry about the audio, but I am doing a voiceover. This is a, uh, I'm not sure what the, uh, I think it's an O species Cuban small. Very small tarantula right now, but uh, really, really lovely colours. This is my Nando Tripepe. Next up we have my very rare Cuban blue tarantula. I cannot pronounce the scientific name for the life of me. This is my Kilobrachys species electric blue. I'm going to try and lure it out for you so that you can get a better look at those stunning colours. And here's a better clip of the Kilobrachys species electric blue. Looking absolutely amazing. This has got to be one of my favourite tarantulas. It's showing me a bit of a, a threat pose here. It's not very happy with me messing with its food, but I wanted to get that blue on camera. So this is my species uh, Negros. Uh, quite a difficult one for me to pronounce as well, but... Um, yeah, just an all black spider at the moment, sort of juvenile size. This is my C. Marshelli. This female has actually um, been sold to a lovely lady, uh, which will be shipped sometime next week. Gramostola pulchra, the Brazilian black. This belongs to Lucy at Lucy's Little Critters. This will be shipped to her next week. This is the Gramostola Pulchra Mature Male. Again, he has been sold and will be shipped off sometime next week. She's not ready for breeding at the size she is, which is why this pair is going to uh, new homes. This was the lovely gift that Reese gave me from the Creatures Cave. Uh, this is my Dory and uh, yeah, absolutely gorgeous spider, super mean, don't want to be putting your fingers in there with this girl. Very nasty bite. Uh, this is my uh, King Krishan, or King Krishan, I think that's how you pronounce it. Oh, nice bit of horrible worm juice going on there. Uh, here's a better clip of it, it's just starting to get some awesome adult colorations. And turning nice and black. My Kilobrachys discolus black female. She was paired quite a while ago and she's just recently started looking very, very chunky. I didn't witness any inser insertions from the male and the male was subsequently eaten. Uh, so I have no idea whether it was successful or not. I guess only time will tell. But she is looking very plump and she molted not too long ago. And she's adult female, so she's not due on malt. So I'm hoping this means she is gravid. Cannot pronounce this one for the life of me. We'll put it on the screen. Uh, beautiful spider. Shame that I couldn't get it to come out any further than this very quick uh, snatch and go that you will get. Gramostola Action, or however you pronounce it. Quite an aggressive feed of this one for a Grammy. Uh, turning out to be one of my favourites. I seem to have a bit of a thing for the uh, red abdomen spiders at the moment. I have a few in my collection and I find them incredibly beautiful to look at. My 
my Formictopus species green femur. Not looking so green right now, but it will be. Uh, the femurs are currently black, but maybe in the next molt or two it will look um, green. This is a female as well, so I'm looking forward to her growing and potentially breeding her in the future. Everybody knows what this is. This is the Chromatopalma sinopubescence. This is a female, uh, the green bottle blue. She's always hungry. She will just eat and eat and eat. But wow, geez, look at those colors. My God. Ignore the phone. I'm just trying to get some light on her. Uh, Nando colorotophyllosus. Shocking pronunciation, but yeah, that's, that's what this one's called. Sorry if you can hear my baby crying in the background. She's supposed to be going to bed, but she's uh, not having any of it right now. <laughs> Lassiodora parahabana, always a good feeder. Malted not too long ago and already looking fat and chunky. This is my little um, H. chiliensis, ex euphilus species red mature male. Looks like it might have some kind of nerve issue going on. This is a very old male. I hope he can survive my female's next molt. Uh, this is the Espoquette or Espoquette. Very, very beautiful spider. Recently molted, believed to be female, not 100% sure. This is the um, Sabar Blue, but not the one that you're thinking of. I, I will put the name on the screen. This came in a mystery box from the spider shop. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and like this video and please comment down below. I love hearing from you guys and uh, it just keeps my channel being interactive and uh, that's, that's the main thing for me. I love hearing from you guys. Uh, I've also noticed that <clears throat> when I look at my graph on my YouTube channel, that only like the dis difference between who watches my channel ver subscribed versus non-subscribed 50% over 50% is subscribed but 40 odd percent are not subscribed which means people are watching my videos but forgetting to subscribe so do subscribe for me oh we have a we have a little human <laughs> uh, so do subscribe and um, I will see you guys next time